I don't know where this road is going to lead. All I know is where we've been and what we've been through. If we get to see tomorrow, I hope it's worth all the pain. It's so hard to say goodbye to yesterday. And I'll take with me the memories To be my sunshine after the rain It's so hard to say goodbye to yesterday And no one can deny this love I have inside. And I give it all to you, my love, my love, my endless love. Happy Lord's Day, everyone. I hope you had a good week. It has been a very busy week. It's been a week of joy, struggle, release, but blessed nonetheless. First and foremost, I'd like to say that my heart and my prayers are out to the Campbell family and the Adams family that are dealing with losses of loved one at this time. And, you know, I just hope that as I pray for them, you pray for them, too. And, you know, it's, I know it's my job, but because I deal with loss and I help others deal with loss, I can always find a reason to be happy. I can always say to myself and say to others that someone might have it worse than I have right now. So I shouldn't look at my problems as, you know, the burdens of the world. But at times when trials, life, issues, state of life, even the situation takes toll on my mind, my heart. I once again try to take myself out of the equation. And I know it sounds cliche or it sounds like a pat answer, but I try to let go and let God. And it's hard to do so. I'm telling you because you want to do all you can to ameliorate, to, to improve on a situation. But oftentimes it proves to be when you let go and let God in that equation and take over and leave it in his hands, in essence, it turns out to be an, a better outcome. And I, I like to remind myself and remind others, he doesn't give us what we want. He gives us what we need. And I'm letting go for the rest of 2024. I'm looking at my issues. I'm looking at things that I'm trying hard to work on, trying hard to improve upon. And I'm letting my father handle my fears. I'm letting my father handle my walls, my goals, my aspirations, some big, some small. I'm letting go. And I'm letting God give me what I need. And I embrace that fact and I implore you and encourage you to do the same. Especially in times of struggle. And even when things go good, be thankful and, you know, let God know that you're thankful for the situation that arised. And, you know, on that note, I encourage you to have a blessed week and let go and let God. Let's go to church. Yesterday, today, forever, Jesus is the same. 
All may change, but Jesus never. Glory to his name. Glory to his name. Glory to his name. All may change, but Jesus never. Glory to his name. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord hath made, that the Lord hath made. We will rejoice, we will rejoice and be glad in it, and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord hath made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord hath made. I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to worship you, O my soul, rejoice. Take joy, my King, in what you hear, and may it be a sweet, sweet sound in your ear. You guys have a blessed week. Enjoy the rest of the Lord's Day. Pray for me as I pray for you, and remember to let go, let God. I love you guys. Bless up.